This is why Kenyans are deeply worried about former President Uhuru Kenyatta just days after his public appearance in Embu County. Vile tumesema Bishop wa waheshimu nyinyi mutarudisha hiyo. So viongozi pia muheshimu wananchi na watarudisha hiyo heshima. While many praised Uhuru Kenyatta's speech during the Catholic event in Embu, sharp-eyed Kenyans couldn't help but notice something unusual about the former president. Despite his radiant smile and charismatic demeanor, there were subtle signs that sparked widespread speculations about his health. Photos of Uhuru at the event quickly began trending online, with Kenyans pointing out visible changes in his appearance. Most notably, his fingernails appeared discolored, an unusual blackish-brown hue that immediately raised eyebrows. Aoko might be right. Our former president Uhuru Kenyatta's health is deteriorating. Just look at his face. Some commented. Praying for Uhuru Kenyatta good health. I hope what Aoko said is not true. Another added. Adding to the speculation, was his uncharacteristic choice to wear a cap throughout the event. When he briefly removed it, some noticed his head was clean shaved, a stark departure from his usual look. And these details fueled concerns that something might be amiss. As the internet buzzed with theories, self-proclaimed health experts weighed in. According to their findings, discolored fingernails or melanonchia can stem from various causes, including subungual melanoma, thyroid disorders, adverse effects of certain medications including chemotherapy, malnutrition, smoking, direct trauma to the nails. Among the possible explanations, one recurring theory stood out that this discoloration might be side effects of cancer treatment. Remember, this isn't the first time rumors about Uhuru's health have surfaced online. Weeks ago, controversial blogger Maverick Aoko alleged on Twitter that the former president was undergoing cancer treatment in Boston. Aoko claimed that the grueling treatment had taken a toll on his physical appearance, causing hair loss and other noticeable changes. I hear son of Mama Ngina isn't too hell, nor healthy, or hearty. Speculations is that it's cancer. Don't worry, I'll get you the inner relevant details. Of course, he is walking chimney, so his lungs giving up on him isn't news. Money is in heaps and bounds. They are buying him as much time as modern medicine can conjure. Lung cancer. Mamangina Amelia Hadia Mejisahau. Uhuru Anakufa. Sio jokes. Aoko said through her Twitter account before she had deactivated it. We must accept that as an African Union, we are greatly... Now her claims gained traction when Uhuru made a rare public appearance in Cote d'Ivoire shortly afterwards. Now observers noted his swollen eyes, visibly altered physique and clean shaved head, all of which align with the side effects of aggressive cancer treatments. Towards the pursuit of national as well as regional objectives. To address the problem systematically, we must have some level of introspection. A fast forward to the Embu event, and Kenyans are once again connecting the dots. The discoloration of his nails, coupled with earlier speculations, has reignited concerns about his health. I fear what Alko was saying might be true. The nail finger of the son of Jomo are turning black. This is today in Embu. One Twitter user said, and despite the growing concern and online chatter, Uhuru's team has remained tight-lipped on the matter, offering no official statement to address the rumors. And the silence only adds to the unease, leaving Kenyans to wonder whether their former leader is truly in good health or if the worrying signs point to something more serious. <laughs> Mambo ya speedy speedy hii na makelele siwezi siku hizi na nipatia headache. Yeah.
Asante sana rais wetu aliye staafu. It is good to see you sir, looking good. We are praying for you. Uh, so that you can also enjoy your retirement and continue supporting our country uh, and, and supporting all of us.